Hi there, this is Ranjit from tech2bus.com and today we'll be reviewing this uh, power line equipment from TP-Link and I'm really excited about this product because this is, has to be one of the best networking products that I have tested. It makes your life very easy and I'm actually going to show you how I implemented this. I have been testing this equipment for now almost three weeks but before I show you how to set it up and use the same and let me talk a little bit about what is this power line uh, ethernet and networking. The thing is that we cannot pull ethernet wires everywhere in a house so what we uh, do we do we generally use wi-fi but the problem with wi-fi is that particularly if you stream a lot of hd content or particularly if you are a gamer then uh, wi-fi is not ideal because uh, sometimes you get lags and the throughput is also not consistent so any day a wired ethernet equipment is faster than wi-fi and what this equipment does is that instead of pulling a ethernet cable from one place to another it uses your uh, electrical wiring in the house to transmit the data so you connect one end of this to one electrical socket and the other end to where you want the internet and i'll show you exactly how i've been using this equipment so let's get on with details of this so this is the tp link uh, power line ethernet kit uh, as this is a kit we get two adapters you can also buy separately but you'll just get one but if you're starting with the power line i suggest that you go for a kit because you'll get uh, two adapters and this is the 200 mbps model we also get 500 mbps model and the model name for this is pa201 kit uh, so this is the actual adapter and it's a very simple device on this end we have the ethernet cable uh, you connect the internet from your router to this and on the front we have three leds one is power one is the plc and if the other power line adapter is connected this one will glow and this is for the ethernet and the plc uh, it actually gives us uh, three states if it's green that means we are getting a speed of more than 80 megabits per second if it is an orange color then it implies that we are getting a speed of about uh, 30 mbps to 80 mbps and it glows in red if the speed is below 30 mbps and it's very simple you just plug this in to your power socket and we are going to do the same now and now we are going to connect this power line ethernet adapter it's very easy uh, you just take one ethernet cable from your router standard router and just plug this in to this adapter and you just insert this into a normal power socket and just plug it in and now we're going to do the same with the other uh, adapter and i have kept the other adapter in another room and i'm going to show you that and actually i've been testing this uh, power line equipment for the past uh, three weeks and i've connected the other end of the power line adapter behind my television in av rack where i couldn't pull a ethernet cable and i'm going to show you the same the other power line uh, adapter and i'm going to switch it on and that gets switched on and i have connected another ethernet cable and now we're going to test it with a laptop now i'm connected to my power line ethernet and the first thing that we're going to do is ping to the router and i want to show you how effective this power line ethernet is for pings it lowers your ping and i'm going to ping to my router and as you can see we are getting a ping rate of about three milliseconds and it's also connected to the net and in my testing i have seen the throughput uh, the lowest the throughput that i got was 24 megabits per second and the highest i got was 45 megabits per second and i uh, streamed a lot of content for example hd videos etc and everything worked without any issues so for example i'll go to tech2bus.com and as you can see we are connected via the ethernet and as you can see it's uh, loading the tech2bus website without any issues this is my samsung netbook and again i want to show the ping we are getting a consistent ping of about 3 milliseconds to 4 milliseconds. About so, uh, now pairing this connection is also very easy. Uh, after just plugging in the devices, you have this button, you just click it and it pairs automatically and you can actually extend the functionality by having multiple adapters like this. Currently the model that you're seeing is the 200 megabits model but we also get the 500 megabits variant. So if you need higher throughput, you can go for that model. I have given the link of uh, TP-Link website in the show notes below so that you can explore the other powerline products that TP-Link offers. 
and in my testing of three weeks uh, this product was very stable and i connected multiple devices and did a lot of hd streaming and even online gaming and it was uh, flawless the quality of connection that you get with powerline equipment depends upon your wiring if you have a modern new home where uh, you have uh, electrical wiring is copper you should be good uh, but if uh, you have a very old house where you're using aluminium wires then uh, the connection might not be that great so i would say this uh, power line ethernet is a very uh, interesting device and this is ideal for people uh, who have already a network or a wi-fi connection but uh, say you have a location in your house or office where the wi-fi reception is patchy uh, you can use you can simply use equipment like this that's power line ethernet and get a stable internet or networking in that area it's very simple to use and in my three weeks of testing i did not face any issues with the same it connects very quickly and actually i connected this unit to a eight port hub and i connected actually four devices uh, in my av uh, room uh, to this uh, power line ethernet so you can safely connect it to a hub and extend the functionality of this device so that's it for now this is ranjit from uh, tech2bus.com and I hope you found this uh, video review interesting. That's it for now. And I hope to see you in my next video.